Hello students in the previous video we have discussed about lexical verb and auxiliary verb today we are going to discuss finite and non finite verb so let's start with finite verb so first understand what is finite verb finite verb are those verb which are controlled by the subject of the sentence it changes as per the tense person or number of the sentence let's take examples for example when i say i play cricket every day right in this sentence play is the verb the same sentence when i write in past tense the sentence will be i played cricket every day so if you see in both the sentences first in first sentence the word play was in present tense it was representing present tense but in the second sentence when i use the word played the word play changes to played and now it's representing past tense so here the verb changes as per tense finite verb changes as per tense now let's see the example how it changes as per person when i say i run a mile daily i run a mile daily here run is the tense sorry run is the verb the similar similarly when i change the person of the sentence the sentence becomes he runs a mile every day or he runs a mile daily so if you will see the difference in the verb run becomes runs so this is the example when verb changes as per person now another example how the verb changes as per number when i say apple is of red color verb is is but when i say the sentence apples are of red color see here the verb changed from is to are so this was the example how verb changes as per number so i hope you all have understood what is finite verb finite verb are those verb which changes as per the tense person or number now let's see what is non finite verb non finite verb are those verb which do not change with the subject non finite verb are those verb which do not change as per the subject it does it does not change as per the tense as per the person or as per the person so what actually it does for example first understand how it does not change i have written a sentence here i found his office at a walking distance i found his office at a walking distance here we have two verb in the sentence found and walking the same sentence when i have converted in future tense akash will find his office at a walking distance if you will notice the first verb found changes to will find but the later one walking remains as it is so this is non finite verb non finite verbs do not function as a verb this is a very uh, this is the catch point okay everyone understand this fact very uh, clearly non finite verb actually do not function as verb it functions as adjective it function as noun or it work as an adverb now let's understand this with different examples how it work as adjective when i say the sleeping cat is brown the sleeping cat is brown here the word sleeping sound like a verb but in this sentence it is acting as an adjective it is telling us it is giving us more information about the noun cat so the word sleeping is actually working here as an adjective now running is a good habit in this sentence running sounds like a verb but here in this sentence it is acting as a noun it is working as a noun 
Another example for adverb, Alia went to the UK to study. In this sentence, the verb to study sound like a verb but again here it is acting as an adverb. It is telling more about the verb. The main verb in the sentence is went. So, I want to repeat once again, non-finite verb are those verb which do not act as a, as a verb, as a main verb, but it work as an adjective, noun or adverb in a sentence.